he got it. Man. But, but that was it. It was it was one audition because it was just for a guest spot with possible recurring. That's all it was. So we had no idea. Me and Liz joke about it all the time. Um, yeah, no one had any idea, even the writers, the producers. No one really saw this going this far, especially me. I yeah. was just, you go, you go to work. This is a big opportunity for me. You be professional, you, you know, you, and that's all you can do. And then me and Liz really got along. And then people seemed to like me and her chemistry a lot. And, uh, you know, four seasons later, I'm still here. Yeah, but I, the cast a lot made it a lot easier to, you know, I wasn't, I, yeah, once, you know, it kind of kept it kept going. And me and Liz talked, she was like, wow, you're here for a long time. Like, they like you. Yeah. Um, Good. Now, you brought up Fallon a bunch of times, and people love following your relationship with Liz Gillies on the show. And Fallon is just magnetic, and you guys have such great chemistry together. It's really fun to watch and see how it plays out season to season. Um, you guys even have a hashtag, right? I mean, I'm yeah. sure you know that. Fal, wait, say it. Falium. Falium. I think, Fal that's, like, I think that's how it goes. Falium. Yeah, Fal plus Liam. Falium. 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 Sounds Italian. I was like, Falium. Hey, Falium. Hey, Falium. Um, your fans, it's, it's they're pizza, great. It's pizza, pasta, Falium. Don't say that's an Italian. Well, I'll go run to my kitchen and start cooking. <laughs> Don't, but um, you guys, so... What is it about your relationship do you think people are so invested in? And, and how is it following it for you as an actor on the show, you know, uncovering that journey with Liz and, and playing out that relationship together? Um, so it's so season one, me and Liz joke about this all the time. I think I said, like, uh, she, we didn't know. We had no idea. You know, it's like, oh, hey, this guy's here. Cool. Um, all right. He comes here to stir up a love triangle between me and Cole Hain. That's all we know. And then so like, and then it was like one, one episode, two episodes, three episodes, four episodes, five episodes. And then, you know, I'm like, I, you start spending every day with somebody. And, it's, and then like, then our friendship really started to build. And she's like, oh, wow, okay, you're here for a long time. Like, I don't think you're going anywhere anytime soon. And so it, it, it was, look, we had great chemistry kind of from the beginning. We, we got along really well offset um and then we got along well on set and i th and i think that plays liz has turned into one of my best friends um you know her and, and her husband michael turned into great friends of mine um and yeah i just i think that our friendship off the screen really shows also on the screen and I think that we both kind of understand there's a yin and a yang to each relationship yeah. You know, and, um, and it's it's all about balance. Yeah. Um, and but like you in so and, and you know Liz knows that like what when Fallon is being crazy, and then when Liam is the voice of reason, and then she has to kind of find figure out for herself that Liam has the best intentions for her, and that he's not because I, I don't have an ulterior motive to to what I'm doing with her her family anything. Um, so I, I just think we understand, you know, that we also, you need to have a strong, a strong relationship on a show. Like you, it, all relationships can't be full of drama or is, but like you want to have something that like kids or adults or whatever it is can look up to. Look, when we watch 90210, we watch Melrose Place, uh, Dawson's Creek, the OC, whatever it is, we always cling to a certain relationship, something right. that feels a little real something that we can relate to, something that we've seen, whether it be like our parents, our sisters, our friends, relationships. And I think that's what Philium is to people. I think yeah. it's a very relatable relationship. They can see, you know, someone has to be the voice of reason in the relationship also, but the person who is a voice of reason, he sometimes goes off the deep end and then she has to talk him off the ledge. So the roles can easily get switched. Um, and it's just been a lot of fun. Look, me and Liz are also very playful. Uh, we like to make each other laugh. We joke around a lot. And, uh, and I think that's, that's helped us a lot with like everything on screen. And the fact that we get along a lot and we've turned into really good friends, it, it just helps it so much more. 
Yeah, it's always so and like, cool. I also, I really, you know, like I said, this is my first show. So I'm learning so much. And I'll tell Liz, I'm like, hey, you're hilarious. You have this comedic timing that I, I, I don't know. I second guess everything I'm doing constantly, every day, 24 seven. So I, and I, I have learned a lot from working with her. And I'll tell her like, hey, if you have like a, if there's a certain way, if I'm not saying the line correctly, or if you think it's funny or this, please tell me. Um, Cause I, I appreciate, you know, in, in respect to your, your opinions and your thoughts on, on what's going on. Cause I honestly think, look, the show's great, but Liz, really is so talented and so fantastic and she just her personality flies off the screen it's hard to take your eyes off of her um and she really she makes that show i mean she, you know she's it's to me it's her show you know there's a she's the number one character on it like her and blake and the rest of the carringtons kind of fall in line but uh, i just so she's she's kind of helped me a lot um not be intimidated, not second guess myself. Um, but yeah, it, no, she, she's helped me a lot to, to just help our relationship on the show, if that makes sense. Yeah, and that's a beautiful thing to have when you work some, with somebody so closely and intimately on screen and then off screen, you have a really deep, not only respect, but a true friendship. I think yeah. you can tell when you watch people and you can realize, oh, they're really, really cool off screen too, you know? Yeah, and, you know, there, it's not a, you know, making a TV show, making a movie, whatever it is, it's a, it's a team effort. Yeah. You know, it's not one person, one whatever it is, it's a complete team effort, and I think we're just a really good team. Yeah, for sure. No, people, the amount of comments I received about the two of you together and how much <laughs> joy that brings people to I watch you guys. People want us to see us together in real life, but Liz is very happily married to an amazing guy um and they're supposed to be together and uh, you know they both turned into huge great friends of mine so yeah yeah it's an awesome thing that's all you can want right yeah so exactly of course it's a it's a carrington wedding something is gonna happen <laughs> someone's gonna try to sabotage it someone's gonna try to ruin it someone's gonna try to break it up or something's gonna happen where you know someone else takes the spotlight or whatever it is um so i think people are gonna i think people are gonna like what happens in the wedding she sings me a song um i almost start to cry it's it's so sweet watching liz perform anytime sing there's no acting required she's just so talented her voice is beautiful and you sit there and watch and her and her husband you know wrote the song for the show um that she sings and it's 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 really beautiful it's a very lovely i know some of the producers said that they got all like choked up and teary eye when they when they you know watched it um so I, th I think it's, it's, it's different. It's very, very different than any other, but our relationship has been different than any, anyone else's on the show. So it's right. a little bit different of a wedding, but it's all, it's, it's very pretty and it's, it's fun. Okay, cool. Well, people look forward to seeing that. And you kind of led to the next fan question, which is, will you ever sing in an upcoming season? Oh man, so <laughs> Liz and uh, her husband, Michael, um, have, uh, they they wrote a song for me to sing um i know they want me to do it really bad and eventually i will lay it down and see what my vocal range is all right 